Well, there are problems to neglecting acid reflux disease. Um, if there's too much acid exposure for too long of a period of time, there can be some thickening that occurs in the wall of the esophagus in response to acid reflux that can lead to scarring and that can lead to a inability for a person to swallow and, and in which case food can get lodged acutely and then a person of course has no ability to get food down or get things up. Saliva will build up in the throat and eventually they end up in an emergency room where we're doing some sort of emergency procedure after hours, which is, is never a good thing. Um, in some cases, it can lead to changes in the tissue in the lower part of the esophagus that are uh, can eventually lead to cancer formation. We call that Barrett's esophagus. That's, again, pre-cancer changes. And in one of the things when we're doing an endoscopy on somebody um, for issues related to acid reflux, we look very carefully in that lower esophagus to see if there are any you know, abnormal looking changes to the lining of the esophagus that need to be biopsied and assessed for these precancer changes.